Right now, you know, when it comes to recycling, many assume that anything with the Chasing Arrows logo can be tossed in the blue bin, and I'm guilty of that, I'll admit right now. But are your eco-friendly efforts being put to waste? Well, here to help us get on track for going green is Lori Hale back with us. She's president of Sister Eden Media. Um, glad you're back. As I was telling you last time you were here, it was an eye-opener for me because I'm one of those. I just see the little arrow logo thing and go, great, that's good. And you told us last time it's not. So a yeah. uh, little true and false we're going to go through here, right? Okay. Okay. Uh, number one, something is plastic or plastic-like, you can put it in recycling. Absolutely not. Just because because it's plastic, you cannot put it in recycling. Okay. So here's some things right off the bat that should not go. Okay. So the little covers that go on food, those little plastic thin film oh, covers, yeah. okay. no. And the protective seals, no. Okay. Um, straws, no. no. Wow. Um, and you know what? You just don't need a straw. Straws are so bad for the environment. Just decline the straw. Okay. Um, the Keurig K-Cups. No, those no. are not recyclable. But okay. Keurig does have a program um, that you can buy these containers that you can put old Keurig cups in, but okay. they cost like fifty to a hundred dollars depending on the size you get. So okay. some offices might order those. But you know what? Just get a French press. Don't do the Keurig <laughs> cups. They're just bad for the environment. Okay. Now the um, clamshell containers. Here's the deal on these. These do vary by jurisdiction. So okay. for example, the district and Anne Arundel County and Howard County, they say absolutely not. We will not take clamshell food containers. Mm -hmm. Montgomery County will take them. Mm -hmm. So it does vary. Now, other types of clamshells are these that hold electronics and toys and things like that. Those usually are not accepted in recycling. So just leave those out, okay. put those in trash. Okay. 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 Wow. Because it really slows down the system, right? When yes, you have... it does. Okay. Yeah. And it's a different type of plastic. Okay. So that's why they can't it's be accepted. It's not going to work. Okay. But wow. again, different jurisdictions use different companies. Companies okay. for their recycling. So definitely check with yours to see. Check what with they... yours. Got to check the website, and we do have those websites on sistreden.com. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Uh, number two, you don't need to rinse out cans or bottles. That's true. Okay. So. Waste management, the big recycling company, says you don't need to rinse them out. However, most jurisdictions says, say do rinse them out, and mm -hmm. here's why. Most of us, we leave our recycling, you know, it sits there in the recycling mm -hmm. bin for days before it's picks up, picked mm -hmm. up. So, you know, bugs and wildlife might get into it, it'll create mm -hmm. a big mess. Mm -hmm. So just rinse it out. And what I do is, you know, every day I always have some bit of hand washing to do with my dishes. So I'll take that leftover water, which is gray water, and that's what I rinse out oh. my recycling in. So so you're not using fresh water. You're not wasting fresh yeah. water to rinse it that out. That makes sense. Okay. Okay. Uh, you should remove labels from cans and jars. Um, you don't need to. Okay. However, in our household, we do because then you can just use the labels and recycle it, put it in with paper recycling. Oh, that yeah. makes sense. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the next one, you don't need to remove lids from bottles. Okay. So again, this is another one that varies by jurisdiction. Okay. So Montgomery County says take it off and Prince George's County, Prince William County, they say leave it on. Okay. So you got to check your local jurisdiction's website. Okay. Next, uh, food bags made of paper can be recycled. Um, okay. So this comes down to food waste and recycling do not mix. So okay. for example, any any paper that has food waste on it should not be recycled. Okay. So these food bags, you're like, you look at it, you're like, oh, it's paper, it can go in recycling. No. Um, because again, there's food waste on it. And also, most of these food bags have kind of like a waxy coating on the inside, so that can't be recycled. Okay. But a minute left, we'll get through these quickly. You can place broken glass in recycling? No, you cannot. Okay. So, Glass that comes from like broken glass from like wine glasses or windows, that is not the same type of glass that's placed in recycling, okay. you know, like your bottles and your right. jars. So you should take that, put it in a heavy duty uh, paper bag, paper grocery bag, mm -hmm. label it, tape it up, put it in your trash okay. so that those guys can see it and dispose of it properly. Okay, quickly, uh, cardboard boxes, take off the tape? You don't need to take off the tape, believe it or not. Okay, yep. okay. And how about foil, foil pans, things like that? Yeah, now if this is coated with food like your mac and cheese, uh -huh. Do not either if you do, can't rinse it out completely, just put it in trash. Do okay. not put it in landfill if it's got food waste on it. And otherwise, if you just have a sheet of aluminum foil, just clean off the food waste, reuse it again and again, and then when you can't use it anymore, just ball it up and throw it in the recycling. Wow, okay, that makes sense. And yep. finally, one I have really quickly 
Pizza boxes. I, I, my, my we talked about my, this last I, I know, time. but I yeah. want to ask one more time to make sure I heard you right. Pizza boxes don't go in. No, because okay. they've got food waste on them. But what if, now, I, what if I, the, I clean out the... It's not. The, if it's got that oil on it, nope. Really? Nope. Wow, but the, the side okay. that doesn't have any food waste, I do tear that up and put okay. it in recycling. Okay, all right, all right. But don't put your food crust, your pizza crust in recycling. Well, I don't. Okay. I don't. I have to put the trash. <laughs> I'm, I'm good. Okay. SisterEden.com is, yes. uh, is the website, and always good to have you here with all Great. the information. We'll also post this as well on our website at WJLA.com. Lori Hill, good to see you again. Thanks. Okay, thanks for schooling us. <laughs>